Hey there, today we're going to talk about how to delete a playlist. And with that, after I answer that question, I also want to share with you how to use playlists that can help your watch time improve. Um, there's a lot of misconceptions that I had when I st first started out and I made a big mess when I try to organize and some of it I'm still cleaning up. But if you watch this and see what mistakes I made and take my advice, <laughs> it's going to make it easier for you in the future. Sometimes when you're doing something new, you end up making a big mess because you don't know what you're doing. So hopefully this will help those of you that haven't started using playlists and it'll help you understand how to use them on your YouTube channel. But first, I will answer the question, how to delete a playlist. And then after that, you can go. Now, you might be wondering why am I outside when I want to talk about playlists. I thought that um, this morning, I, I'm trying to incorporate more than one thing at a time, kind of like multitasking, but in a positive, productive way. And this morning, I had to go get the mail. I had to put the mail in the mailbox. And I, I thought, well, walk down there. It's a quarter of a mile to get there. And I get some exercise. And then I grabbed my phone and thought, well, do your intro for the video that you're doing today. So we got three in one today. But that's one of the things we're going to be talking about, how a playlist can help your video be in several places at once and get more views. So it all kind of goes together. All right, we're at the end of the driveway. I'm out of breath. And we're going to get the mail. And there's one in there from yesterday. All right, we're gonna head back and let's get on that computer and find out all about playlist. Whoops. First thing I'm gonna show you is how to delete a playlist. So this is assuming that you've already created a playlist. If you don't even know how to create a playlist, then please look at my video that I'm showcasing right now above and it's a video on how to create a playlist. Now I'm going to show you how to delete one. So you've got your playlist already created. You go into YouTube Studio and then on the left here in the on menu, you can see playlist and that's what I have. I do have several playlists and I'm going to talk about that in a moment. But let's go under money making tips on YouTube and we go into that little pencil and we're going to edit the playlist. Now, if you decide you want to change the title, maybe you like that those videos are grouped together, but you just want to change the title, don't delete the playlist. Just go up here to this little pencil and, and edit the title. Very easy to do, okay? But if you want to delete it, you're done with it, then you want to go under these three little dots and down here at the bottom, it says delete. Now, do not delete them until you have reassigned your videos. Now, in this case, I just started this playlist. This is actually the playlist where I'm gonna start talking about my income. I'm gonna do a quarterly income statement and this is where I'm gonna put it in this playlist. But maybe I wanna re I want to just get rid of this playlist. I don't even wanna rename it. I want these all to go in three different directions. Then what I have to do, I have to literally open that video and then I have to go back to the editing of that video and make sure I remove it from that playlist. So you went in, you know, when you went to do the um, instructions on the description and all of that, you go right back to that page where it says to edit the video. I have another one that I pulled up. Let's look at that one. I've already had it. Here's one that I already had up. Um, what you want to do is go in and then you would open up the playlist list okay, and then remove it from the playlist that you're getting rid of. Now, if you were only here to find out how to delete, that's how you delete, you may go. What I want to talk about now is just a couple little tips that I have for you on what I've learned about playlists and the mistakes that I made. And just, just want to help you not make those same mistakes. That's what my channel is all about, helping you as a new YouTuber. And I want you 
to do it right the first time and not get it wrong and have to have a mess like I did. When I first started out, I made a video every single day and I went into my channel and I thought everything had to have a playlist. That's not the right page, this one. This is my channel page. Now what I've done, I've cleaned it up. Um, this is where your playlist will show and this is what people see when they come to see your channel page. In, oh, about six months ago, I probably cleaned it up. I was putting every single video in a playlist is what you should do. That part was right. But I thought that every single playlist had to be on my channel and it doesn't. I thought that if I didn't show it on the channel, that it wouldn't show up. And that was a mistake on my part. And I don't know, I remember researching that, but I don't know why I got the wrong information. So don't worry if you have playlists created don't worry that um, it's not being seen here because you might not want them to be, okay? So let's go back to this one. I've got this one, oh, not that one. I've got this one in three different playlists. And you might say, well, why would you do that? Because when a person clicks this video, depending on, it's, it's going to show up in the playlist when they look over to the right side of the, their computer, they're gonna see suggested videos. Well, my videos are gonna come up as suggested from the playlist and sometimes they can get caught in that playlist and just seeing one after another that is what improves your views so the more playlists that you have your video in the better it's going to help you but please make sure that the title of the playlist goes with the video don't just willy-nilly put them in a bunch of playlists because then people will get mad because if i'm looking how to make money making money tips on youtube i don't want um something else to be in there like motivation and mindset. I want to be reading about money making tips on YouTube. Now, another thing that I've done that helps me, you saw on my channel that I have, I think I have six different playlists on there, plus my vlog. I just started that about a month ago. It has, it's not very old. Um, those are on my channel page. Anything that has a little star next to it, like this one's called tutor tutorials. I am not putting that on my playlist, mainly because my channel isn't really about tutorials, but sometimes I might find a new social media platform, which kind of goes with YouTube. If you're trying to get your YouTube out there and you want lots of people to see it, then you want to be aware of the platform. So yes, it's information my audience might want, but it's not really what my channel is specifically about. So I put it in a playlist and I put it a star next to it so that I know do I want this video on my channel page or do I want it just in a playlist? And that kind of tells me without me having to double think and not have to have a list, okay? So there's a lot of things in here like passive income, affiliate products, traffic, sales funnels, lots of things that go with businesses and YouTube, but aren't. I wanna focus more about YouTube on my channel page, if that makes sense. So you'll have to decide that. Now, there's another thing that I did. Many years ago, not many years, two years ago, I started many years, two years ago, I started my channel. I have a lot of old videos. You're going to have them too someday. You'll be excited. You'll have th about 300 videos and you're going to go all the way back to those first 50 or so and go, oh my gosh, what are they doing on my channel? Let me get rid of them. Don't delete them. Leave them on your channel, but unlist them. If you unlist the video, then the video can still get watched. People can still search for it. They can still find it. You can still make money. I, I'm making money off of these unlisted videos. I'm just not making a lot. And the videos are, maybe they don't really apply to anything that I'm doing, but people are searching for them and they're watching them and they might have views. So what if they only have 25 views? You know, 10 times 25 is 250 views and so on. You know, you can do the math. So what I do, sometimes when I, I just don't, I feel like piddling, maybe my husband's watching TV and I sit there and have has to watch the TV and, and sit here and clean up my videos. That's kind of the kind of work I do when I'm, I'm double, doing double duty there, multitasking. But I put them in the unlisted video playlist then I know where they're at. They're all sitting in one place. Make sure every video that you make is in some type of a playlist. And you might even have one that says, I don't know. Um, I tell my mom that when we're getting rid of stuff, I say, put it in the I don't know box, right? Do that with your videos. If you're not sure <laughs> where you want to put it, just make a playlist that says, I don't know. Um, and then you can deal with it later. But hopefully this was helpful for you so that you can see um, how those playlists work.
and you can always go back and change them. One of the things I did at the top, and I'll share that with you, I have some videos that did really, really well. My, you know, 1,000, oh, not that one, keep going up one more. All of these have hit over 1,000, uh, 3,000 as of this one. Um, I put my popular uploads here. And the reason I did that is I wanted, I'm not really making that, getting that many views on every um, video. You, if you've watched my channel, you know that. I've got some that are still under 100. You know, some go into the hundreds and then some go into the thousands. They're kind of all over the place. That's okay. But I wanted people to see when they came to my channel that, hey, I do have some videos that hit in the thousands and there are people looking for my stuff. Um, so if I only put current videos, I found that I don't get thousands of views right away. I usually start out like a hundred and then it kind of builds slowly. So I put my popular uploads there for now. Now when my channel gets bigger and I get a thousand or 2000, 5,000 views right away, I'm going to put my current uploads up there. But I, like I said, it, you could do anything you want, but that's my reasoning for putting that there. Okay. So there you go. That's how you delete your playlist and those are some tips for you okay and don't forget if you want to know how to create it a playlist go back and hit that um, how to create a playlist or you can find it here on my channel just google it and you can figure it find out the steps and how to do that as well and i'll go and i go into more detail as well on how to do all of this all right thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe stop right now hit the subscribe button and you'll get a video every week and i will see you next week same place, same time. Thanks for watching.